Start by downloading Meshroom for free at Atlas Vision. Once you have downloaded the software, you can import your images by dragging them into the image area. The software will read the metadata from your photos. I took these photos with my phone camera, so not all of the metadata is complete, and that's why you see an orange circle next to the photos. If you see a green circle, that means all of the metadata could be read. Meshroom works on a node space system, meaning each node or block feeds data into another through a string of connections. You can change your preferences with each node. When you're ready to begin processing, right click on the texturing node and press compute to go through the entire workflow at once. You can also press the green start button at the top. You can see the status of the workflow in the bar at the top and in the node section. Green meaning that that step has been completed. Once the structure from motion phase is completed, you will see the sparse point cloud. You can also change the size of the points. I would recommend making them a bit bigger so you can have a better idea of how your model will be structured. When the entire workflow has been completed, you can double click on the mesh node and the texture node. You can then toggle on and off the mesh view on the in the right toolbar and then you'll see the completed texture. You can export your model from here or if you would like to simplify it in order to make the file size smaller for uploading online, you can create a new mode by right clicking in the node section, searching mesh decimate and choosing the amount of vertices that you would like it to be decimated to. You will then need to make a connection from the mesh filtering output into the mesh decimation input. Then press compute. Once the mesh is decimated, you will want to reapply the texture. You can do this by duplicating the texture node. You will then make a connection between the mesh decimation and the texture node. You now have a complete decimated textured model.